Today we are discussing the CCNA based interview questions and answers for Cisco SD WAN Solutions 300 415. You can download the complete list of CCNA based questions from the link provided in the description. Our interview question based on SD WAN Solutions is can you explain the concept of active active van age deployment in Cisco SD WAN and its benefits? Your answer should be active active van age deployment in Cisco SD WAN involves deploying multiple van age routers V age at each branch office and utilizing all WAN links concurrently. This approach offers several benefits including increased bandwidth utilization, improved load balancing, and enhanced resilience. By distributing traffic across multiple links, active-active deployment optimizes WAN performance and minimizes the impact of link failure. Our next interview question is How does Cisco SD WAN ensure secure communication between branch offices and data centers? Your answer should be Cisco SD WAN ensures secure communication between branch offices and data centers through several mechanisms. First point Encrypted transport. All traffic across the SD WAN fabric is encrypted using strong encryption protocols, ensuring confidentiality and integrity. Next point is IPsec VPN. Cisco SD WAN supports IPsec VPN tunnels for secure communication over untrusted networks providing end-to-end -end encryption and authentication. Next point is zone-based firewall. Integrated firewall capabilities allow for the enforcement of security policies at the branch level protecting against unauthorized access and threats. Our next interview question is what considerations should be made when designing high availability for Cisco SD-WAN? Your answer should be when designing high availability for Cisco SD-WAN considerations include First point, redundancy. Deploying redundant WAN age routers, V age and control plane components V smart controllers for device label and control plane redundancy. Next point is link diversity. Utilizing diverse WAN links, for example, MPLS and internet, and implementing dynamic path selection for automatic failover and load balancing. Next point is geographic redundancy. Distributing SD WAN components across geographically diverse locations to mitigate the impact of site failures or disasters. Next point is resilient design. Implementing resilient network architecture such as active active WAN age deployment and multi-homed connections to ensure continuous connectivity and minimal downtime. If you are preparing for any Cisco-based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid 
tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below.